Let us solve another question on profit maximization that was asked by a brother on YouTube channel of Econ Maths. Uh, the question is like this: A monopolist has a cost function is Tc is equal to 10 plus 2q. Tc denotes total cost and q denotes the output. Demand in this market is being given us. This is our demand function. Q is equal to 14 minus P, where P is the price and Q is the quantity demanded. Calculate the profit that the monopolist will be making. We need to find out the uh, maximum profit uh, that this monopolist will be making. Okay. Now, how do we calculate the profit uh, maximization problem in case of monopolist? So, we use uh, the condition that we I have uh, written most number of times in our videos and which is of course the profit maximization uh, condition that is our marginal revenue should be equal to marginal cost okay so we need to equate these two to get the profit maximizing level of output okay after that we can find out the profit okay so we are being given this uh, demand function okay so let's write it here first so we have q is equal to 14 minus p solving for p first this so if i transpose this p here we get 14 minus q okay simple uh, transpose i have made here now to what is total revenue so we need to find out first the marginal revenue to find marginal revenue we need to find out first the total revenue total revenue as you know is simply price into quantity okay so this is our price function that is 14 minus q to this we multiply q okay so this becomes a 14 q minus q square this is our total revenue now marginal revenue is simply the derivative of total revenue with respect to quantity simply differentiating this function with respect to q gives us marginal revenue the derivative of q is 1 so we are left with 14 in the first term here the derivative of q square is 2q 2 becomes coefficient we have q and this uh, exponent is subtracted by 1 so this becomes 2 minus 1 is 1 okay so this is our marginal revenue okay if i can uh, draw it graphically here also so this is our quantity axis this is our price axis our demand function is being given us uh, this very thing so we have intercept here 14 this is our demand function or average revenue function and this is our marginal revenue function intercept is here same okay but slope is twice um, that of the demand curve let us denote this marginal revenue here this is our marginal revenue okay so we need to find out now the marginal cost now total cost is being given us is 10 plus 2q marginal cost simply the derivative of total cost function with respect to quantity means differentiating this function with respect to q derivative of constant is zero so we don't write it here derivative of q will be one so we are left with two okay this is our marginal cost here so let us uh, let's write it here so our marginal cost will uh, look like so this is our marginal cost now profit maximization requires profit maximization requires our marginal revenue should be equal to marginal cost so they intersect at this point this is our intersecting point and we need to find out uh, the output level corresponding to this uh, point okay for that we need to equate marginal revenue and marginal cost that means we have in place of marginal revenue we have 14 minus 2q and we equate it with marginal cost which is only 2 okay solving for q here so transposing this 2q gives us 14 minus 2 or 2q is equal to 12 or q is equal to simply 12 upon when we transpose it gets divided we get six okay so profit maximizing level of output will be six okay so we got profit maximizing quantity as six so let me write it here we also need to find out the price corresponding to this quantity okay so how can we find we need to find out 
this very point okay corresponding to this q we need to find the price here okay at this point now just plug this q is equal to 6 in our demand function to get the price here okay so our price will be equal to 14 minus q in place of q we have 6 so we get price is equal to 8 okay so we have price 8 here now what is profit profit is simply equal to uh, total revenue that the monopolist will receive minus total cost okay and total revenue is simply price into quantity you know that very thing and total cost is being given us this very function that is 10 plus 2q what we need to do we just need to plug the value of p p and q in this uh, function to get the profit level so p is 8 quantity is 6 minus we have 10 uh, plus 2 in place of q we have 6 so this is r minus we have 10 here this minus plus is minus 2 6 is 12 so this comes out to be so we have 38 minus 12 which gives us autumn values that dry share then so we got the profit maximizing sorry uh, the maximum profit that this monopolist will get is 26 okay it was very simple i have solved number of questions on there but because it was asked by a brother and he insisted to solve this question so i just solved for him this question okay i hope i make myself uh, clear in this video uh, if you like these videos please share these videos with your friends that will be only motivation for me to keep going on i am not um, even charging a single penny for that very question uh, any friend can ask the questions that i feel i could uh, solve okay i'm just a student of economics in that capacity uh, i cannot solve all the stuff but uh, whatever i can do in my capacity i will try to solve the questions for you people okay so my endeavor will be uh, to inculcate uh, the mathematical uh, uh, stuff uh, in your uh, economics okay i hope i make myself clear in this video thank you